Hi guys, today's video is going to be workwear for summer. This has been highly requested. It's been one of the things that people have most asked for. And I think possibly just because there's a lot of YouTubers out there that you want to see the style of, but not a lot of them have a regular job. And I do work three days a week. Unfortunately, we've been going through, as I'm filming this right now, a weird period of weather where it's very warm, but it's humid and it's not really sunny and it rains all the time. So I've been kind of put off doing this. In fact, I'm fairly certain it's raining right now. It is. Um, so <laughs> it's been really like, oh, when, do I, when can I film this video? Um, and so I'm just gonna do it because I've been wearing the same stuff because it's been so warm. And a lot of it's gonna be very, very similar. It's lots of skirts and tops, but we will go through and I'll show you everything that I wear for work when it's warm now. Last year I really, really struggled because we had that heat wave and I was not prepared. This year I was more prepared. So this top number one is from um, that website Sheen, Shine. You know, the one that used to be Sheen inside um, or Shine, whatever it was. I really like this. It's got a little tie. It just adds a little bit of shape. When I wear something high-waisted, I like this for my body shape and an apple. So basically I am like larger on the top. I have thin legs. That's effectively an apple. I carry it all the way on my top half. So this, it doesn't kind of add width, I suppose is the word I'm looking for. And it still kind of nips me in at the waist I don't really have because I don't have a tremendous amount of shape here, but it kind of gives the illusion of that. I'm not hippie. If ever anything's got hips built into it, you know, like actually is, um, what's what I'm looking for? Tailored. Um, it's just like bagginess either side. So I like this for me. Um, but equally, you could wear a top and just tuck it in. Um, I used to do that all the time and I really didn't like that on me. And so these little cropped up with the ties have been a revelation. The skirt that I'm wearing is from Primark. I really like this skirt. Um, I think I'm going to go back and see what else they've got in terms of like midi skirts and culotte style things. Uh, you may see those by the end of this video because I've been living in this kind of thing since it's been warm. And the shoes I'm wearing, I'll show you. Uh, these ones I've mentioned before, they're the YSL dupe, I think they were like six pounds and the YSL one's about 45. They're, they're a dupe for what I think are called the Muse sandal, I can't remember. Um, but very, very comfortable. For a non-leather sandal, this is all very, very soft. Um, the only thing I would say is they do that, you know, they're like, as you walk, I kind of hate that and it squeaks a little bit. This squeaks, but if that doesn't bother you, no big deal. Jackets and stuff. I've been wearing a lot of denim jackets, uh, or at least I've been wearing one denim jacket a lot. <gasps> also, I broke my nail. Oh no, it's not that hand, it's this hand. I broke my nail, I'm gonna get that fixed today. Um, but yeah, I'll be back tomorrow with another one. Today I'm wearing this dress. This is from Primark, a little while ago, a few months ago. I think it's super flattering, I really like the cut of it. It's like the way it hits, the, the where it hits, the way it hits. Where it hits here, I really like the slightly longer sleeves. It's just a really nice kind of comfortable dress. If they did different um, styles of this, then I would not styles, different prints and stuff, then I would wear them, I would buy them before I wore them. Um, and I'm wearing the same sandals as yesterday and we are promised thunderstorms this week. So crazy, crazy. Also, by the time you see this, this makeup, I did an IGTV get ready with me. That's the thing I do now. Today is possibly the most humid day of all. Um, and I really didn't know what I was gonna wear. So I ended up wearing this, which is like a summer dress. It's like a, properly like a beach dress. And then I've put over the top of it a shirt that I've, I mean, I'm literally just describing what you can see, but I've put over the top of it a shirt that's just tied. And it's a very, very thin shirt, but it just kind of makes it a little bit more office appropriate. It definitely still has a beachy vibe. I could still wear this like on holiday if I want to, um, but it, it doesn't feel like a lot. And yet I'm quite covered. Um, I'm going to probably wear the black version of those sandals that I showed you yesterday. Oh my goodness, you scared me today. Next arena. <laughs> wow, well done. <laughs> Hello, today's outfit is, oh, both Primark again. What do you know? Um, this I really like. I like these knotted t-shirts. I told you that in a previous clip, but this is from Primark and a little bit easier accessible uh, or easier to get your hands on. And I'm going to go back for some more, I think, while they're still doing them because it's just perfect. Again, it kind of gives me that it just gives me the illusion of waist because I am the widest around here, um, which I'm cool with. It's just it's nice to have a point of waist, isn't it? Um, these trousers are absolutely amazing. The mirror is so dirty, I'm realising as I film. But hey, um, these trousers are absolutely amazing, but a bitch to iron. They crease really, really badly. When I sit down, all of this, like this was just, um, this was horrendous before I started ironing, imagine. But I've just been sitting down and it kind of creases really badly. Once I've been at work for a while, this will just become kind of like one tiny band. Um, 
but something about this flat front I think is really flattering. I really like it. It's also got an elastic band. Elastic band, it's also got an elastic waist, which kind of sucks. What? That almost makes me look like I've got a waist from that angle. Um, and I love the colour. The shoes are from Topshop. And yeah, feeling very genie-ish in this. Um, and I'm probably going to wear something very, very similar tomorrow. Really quickly, um, today's jumpsuit is from Next. I really like this one. It's like a crepe, really thin material. It's kind of more of a beach cover-up, but I am wearing it with a little cardigan to make it a little bit what off is appropriate but it's also kind of because it weighs nothing um really really nice for the heat and i'll be wearing my flat sandals but they're downstairs and i just wanted to mention it because it's a particularly good one if you are planning on going out afterwards let's say the sun is shining you want to go to a beer garden or you've actually got kind of like dinner or something this is actually something that you can wear with high heels and it's quite it really elevates um this outfit to just put on a pair of heels and suddenly it feels like an evening outfit but this is something i will be wearing a lot this summer we may have reached the end i haven't decided whether or not i'm going to keep going from here because uh, this is the end of my work week this week um but today apparently i'm dressed like a pirate i've got full stripes on i pulled this out of my um summer wardrobe on top of my wardrobe pulled all the stuff down and this was in it i was really excited to find another one of these like weird kind of twisty tie tops that i like um and these trousers a little bit shorter i'll we're doing some great animals today. No, I still can't show you the bottom. How are we going to do this? I'm standing on the bath side, of course. These trousers are from Primark. Of course they are. Everything's from Primark. Um, apart from the shoes, which are from Topshop. Really, really comfortable, by the way. They were forever old, but if you ever see them again, buy them because they are really comfy. Um, yeah, these are like a crepe material. So again, they're made of nothing. Really nice for summer weather, but also very much, and again, pockets. Uh, very much kind of office appropriate. This may be more so, you know, or less so rather, more casual um, than your average because it is a little bit kind of crop toppy. I would prefer it to kind of be a little bit further down and covered. Um, but this has basically been my kind of uniform for work recently, as you have seen. It's finally the last clip, I promise. This is definitely the last outfit. And I am utilizing my tripod, finally. This is the kind of um, professional setup you should expect from me. So, the last outfit is a jumpsuit. I have to kind of just, Manny is sleeping on the floor and he has absolutely, does not care that I'm filming this at all. He's just sprawled out. Um, this is a jumpsuit. I'm just wondering what's in the background because often I film things like this and I think, no, yeah, nothing. Um, <laughs> I'm wearing a jumpsuit from Primark. This is from last year, um, but you may still be able to get something similar. Failing that, eBay. eBay is your best friend when it comes to things from previous seasons. Um, and what I really, really like about this is it's got a black stripe down this side. So when I wear a little t-shirt, because I don't want to feel, because as a jumpsuit, it is like a, a cami kind of jumpsuit. Um, I prefer to be a little bit more covered than that when I'm at work, uh, most of the time, and it has cooled off ever so slightly. And so today, here we are, um, I feel like I've just said I want to be a little bit more covered than that. I wear like little vest tops and stuff to work all the time, which is true. But there's something about this being all in one that feels like I'm not wearing much. And I think that's why I want to wear a t-shirt over this. It's the feeling of it being not as covered as regular clothes. Anybody else with me? Um, so yeah, I like, I like that I can basically make this into uh, pattern trousers with a little top like this. And this top happens, it's the same top I've shown you throughout. This top happens to hit exactly at the waist of the jumpsuit. And what I would do is these little dangly parts, which, oh, he's moved. I'm obviously annoying him. Um, I would kind of tuck them in to that part so they weren't dangling down. But I really, really like this. And I like that the black stripe kind of almost brings it all together. The shoes I'm wearing are these, which is the black version of the shoes I've shown you already in this video. Um, I don't usually wear the black ones because I think that they, oh, are you ready for an unflattering angle? Um, I don't usually wear the black ones because I think they, Kind of cut me off when I wear um, shorts or dresses or whatever. Um, I just don't like the contrast on me. Um, but with trousers or a jumpsuit, no problem. And I thought black was for the best. And also, people ask me what bags I carry. And I do have some really nice handbags. Um, and I know that this might not be what you're expecting. Because I do have some really nice handbags. But this, I wore this all last summer and I'm wearing it again now. It's just like the, the summer bag of all um and it, i've worn it to death i've actually lost two tassels on there but if you could get your hands again if it's still in h&m if they brought it back for this year or if you can get it on ebay i love this bag so much so much it holds loads if i'm going shopping because i'm sorry i never remember my bags for life 
But if I'm going shopping and just after work picking some stuff up, I can get a decent amount of stuff in here without even having to think about it. Um, I'll throw like dinner, bottle of wine, whatever, everything in there. Um, and if we're out with the children, I just, I love the ease of just being able to throw things in a bag. And I really, really love this bag. I also had another one, it was nothing like this, but this kind of um, casual cotton type bag, a throw of your shoulder. In the summertime, it's just, there's nothing better. I love this so much, so I thought I would show you that. Um, however, I have just ordered, I got a tax rebate, I'm very excited. Um, I have just ordered a little leather backpack, which if you would be interested, let me know and I will do, because me and Milo are going to um, or Milo and I are going to London just on our own and I, well, I'm hoping to pack us both in just two little backpacks that we can carry just in case we need to walk around the city where, like holding them all day um, so let me know and I may do a video on that as well when it comes so yeah thank you for joining me I uh, hope this has been useful I, I'm very very aware that my office is super casual so it may not work for everyone but if not then these are just kind of like summer outfits um, and yeah Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Every time.